got a hit in the first inning of yesterday's action and did not reach with a hit again. Did get a walk later in the game. Watches a fastball outside, and it's 1-0. and Glorious batting 3.09 on the season. This fastball from Crick misses low and outside. Right-hander not finding his location early on. And very quickly, it's 2-0. and out. Crick rocks and fires. This one up and inside. Easy take for Jorge Flores. Just watching Crick miss with his location over and over. It's the kind of game he's trying to avoid. Fastball right down the pipe. And that one will get a called strike. Crick, a former first-round pick of the Giants. There's another fastball down Broadway here for a called strike. And it is 3-2 and two out of high school in Texas, native of Fort Worth. Last time out, gave up no runs on four hits and six walks over five and a third innings. Skating by danger there. This fastball misses up and inside, and that's the first walk of the day for Crick. He puts Jorge Flores on with one out here in the bottom of the first. Fisher Cats are down one to nothing against the Flying Squirrels. Here at the bottom of the first, Ollie the Bat Dog picking up that bat and taking it over to the dugout. That's great hustle, Ollie. Love to see him for him. So now a runner at first and one away. Here's Melky Mesa to the plate. Did not appear in yesterday's action. Mesa batting 358 with two homers and eight runs batted in. Watches a slider outside. Maybe a cut fastball. Judging by the movement, and it's 1 0. Mesa hailing from Hyena in the Dominican Republic as Flores leads away over at first. Mesa with a healthy rip at this fastball high in the zone, did not make contact. And it evens the count one ball, one strike. Fisher Cats already with some ground to make up after giving up a run. First two batters faced by Joel Pinheiro. Was able to retire the next three, all on ground outs. Slider ripped foul up the third base line. And that makes it one and two. Two milkies. Flores taking off for second on the two-strike pitch. The throwdown is not in time. Great job by Flores making a good read on a 95-mile-per-hour fastball. No margin for error there. And he swipes second as Mesa strikes out. So now a runner at second. And two away here in the bottom of the first. Fisher Cats down by a run. Flores now up to four stolen bases on the season after pilfering that bag. Kevin Nolan to the dish for the Fisher Cats, native of Nashua. Coming to the plate, batting 303 with four homers and 22 runs batted in. Which is a slider down low. Only one ball and no strikes. Nolan yesterday, one of four, one of only three Fisher Cats to collect hits in the game. Also stole a base. Watches the fastball high and away. Crick all over the place with his location here in the first inning. Crick sets again. Pitch. Fastball in there for a called strike this time. Nolan not willing to get aggressive against a guy like Crick who has shown he has the tendency to be wild. Two one pitch. Cut fastball low and inside and a good take by Kevin Nolan. Working it into a hitter's count three and one. Runner at second and two away. Here in the bottom half of the first inning with New Hampshire trailing Richmond, one to nothing. Here's the 3-1. No, it's a spin 
by Crick. Looking Jorge Flores back to the bag at second. Fisher Cats making Crick work a little bit here in the bottom of the first. Already over 20 pitches. And he misses outside with a fastball, putting Kevin Nolan aboard. So that's two walks in the inning. He's also struck out one. 